But anyway, let's uh let's talk let's talk some magic. Let's talk some magic, baby. Let's go. Now, obviously this is a pretty mindless deck. <laughs> There's really not much to talk about with this thing. I just wanted to play cards and deal damage. Right? Like you could, you know, you could play Woe Strider and claim the firstborn and all that garbage, but <laughs> don't deal damage. I mean, I guess you attack with them, they deal damage, but you know, um, they they don't just they don't just deal damage because you want them to. And that's that's what I want. I want to combine Bastion of Remembrance with Carter the Doom Scourge because I think you can probably get a whole bunch of damage like this. Probably it's likely. So <laughs> I like the idea of that. <laughs> There's just one copy of Ayara because it does damage. Bone Crusher Giant does damage. Kazul's Fury. That thing does damage when you sacrifice a Croxa with the trigger on the stack. you got to go full control. Remember that. You go full control with the trigger on the stack and five mana open. You know, you cast your Croxa. And while that's on the stack, you um, Kazul's Fury it. So you can get as much as nine damage from that. It's pretty uh, sexy. And Crocs is also just good to have in the late game, I guess. You know, a little resiliency. Why not? And then Serrated Scorpion does damage. Fireblade Charger does damage. So does Shock. Royal Eruption does damage. Not a very good card, but it does damage. <laughs> Stormfist Crusader does damage every turn so we're just trying to pressure the opponent as much as we possibly can and not get into nightmare matchups like any life gain deck at all although I did beat a life gain deck today before coming on stream um, and I believe we were on the draw too so it was kind of cool it's not going to happen every time but so far Carter has been like better than I thought because Carter looks like a really terrible magic card it's really bad. <laughs> I, mean, I think we can all agree this looks terrible. But um, Carter can set up some like really awkward attack steps for your opponent, or you can just like let your opponent get through with damage. You know, if you're not going to die, and that opens up your whole side of the board to swing through on the next turn if they don't play an untapped creature um, on the next turn. So there's some cool stuff that this deck can do, but mostly we're just trying to count to 20. It doesn't even have to be as fast as possible. I just want all the cards to be capable of helping count to 20. <laughs> That's, that's that's it, son. Let's see what we're working with. What do we got, baby? All right, we can play these cards. That's all I care about. I'm going to go first. It's my kind of night. I can feel it in the air. I can feel it calling in the air tonight. Ba -ba 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 -bum -bum. Let's get a red source. I'm just going to charge in this turn. Oh, you're going to sack Fable Passage on the combat step? I like it. I like that. Slow things down a little bit. Sonic Snow-Covered Mountain. Off of a Fabled Passage. What are you doing? What are you doing over there? Frostbite Blizzard Brawl deck, perhaps, with Brushfire Elementals and Kazandu Mammoths? I nailed it. All I have to see is one card. All I need is one mic. It's not that deck. <laughs> it's not that deck at all, in fact. Well, let's boop. Bastion, you're going to counter it? You're going to not let us play magic cards against you? whole point of the game is to play magic cards. And yet, blue gets to play cards that don't let you play magic cards. Oh, you're going to bone crush the charger. Eh, it's fine. Bastion! Ariel! <laughs> Sebastian of Remembrance. <laughs> Oh, cat cam. <laughs> My beautiful wife told me to move the cat cam. Thank you. Thank you. Beautiful, beautiful Brittany of, of, of mine. You don't belong to me. <laughs> I hate when people say, like, of mine. Cause I, don't be I'm not, I don't belong to nobody. <laughs> I am my own person. Thank you. All right, so hey, you've tapped out playing Invasion. So it's just giants. It's just, is it giants? That's all this is. It ain't even really a deck. <laughs> it is a deck. <laughs> to be a little worried. I could Kazil's Fury the Serrated Scorpion right now. Rock your world, dog. Alright, so you're going to play this Bone Crusher next turn, aren't you? This, draw a card. Whenever you reveal a giant card, when you do, it deals two damage. Okay, who cares? Who cares about that? So you probably just Bone Crusher. And I'm thinking about Royal Eruptioning because I just want a Carter next turn, right? That's all I really want to do. Put him at 12, and then Doom Scourge. This could work. 12, 11 to 9, 11, 10, 9, 8. Put him at like 8. It's not good enough, but 
I'm gonna do it, dude. Like I said, I just want to hit. I just want to hit for damage. That's all I want to do, son. <laughs> a thousand bits for hello, Brittany. As soon as Brittany slams into chat. <laughs> Flee with the thousand bits. <laughs> Thank you very much. You also gave me a hundred for having cats on the stack. Maybe I should leave them on the stack more often. Opponent with a bunch of open mana here. They decided not to play Bone Crusher, which is interesting. Like maybe they have a counter spell. I bet they have a counter spell. But maybe they're just holding up Bone Crusher Giant. That's all that's really happening here. Could play Stormfist, but it'll just get gianted. I'm a Carter. Dakota! Even though, like, this whole line of text doesn't matter if they don't have creatures in play. What you got? You gonna double bone? Oh, Frostbite. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Think I care? You're gonna bone crusher this token. And go to 10. Oh, wow. He actually bone crushered the serrated scorpion. I was not prepared for that. <laughs> go to 7 this turn. Okay. Well, we gotta draw some cards. We do have to draw some cards. Remember that we have the Simmerstorm Skrull Cairn here. So it might be better just to have Kazul's Fury for as a land. Let's see here. So this token's probably going to put him at six one way or the other, even if they kill it. Calamity Bearer. Oof. Eek. That's all they got, though. We get a land. That's good, in a way. So hopefully they don't have any more Bone Crushers in their hand. That's Stormfist. I think I still want Fury, though. I'm going to try to Bone Crusher it. This is an instant, and I don't have open red mana. I thought I did. Okay. Hmm. I need two red mana for this, don't I? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Hmm. I was really hoping that we get the Fury there. <laughs> Alas, they start the game with three Bone Crushers in their top 16 cards. Well, we got a block. We're starting to... We're in trouble <laughs> at this point, but maybe we'll draw some magic cards. It's possible, right? Yeah, this is a, it's definitely a magic card. You jerk. <laughs> there you go. Boy, we take some damage this turn, don't we? Whew. Ooh, we take some damage. Bam, we're at six. God, that's ridiculous. <laughs> Oof. Oof, oof. We were at 23 to start the turn. They're just going to Bone Crusher, say go. You get a Bone Crusher. It's not good enough. Put him at three. Well, hold on here. Well, I'll play the Bone Crusher. I'll take two damage to my own Bone Crusher here. Oh, no. I don't have to target anything. Okay, so it doesn't matter either way. Boop. Wish I had a Calamity Bear. Oh, wow, that actually wins the game. I forgot about Bastion. I'm stupid. Yeah, somebody was like Bastion in chat. I see that now. I just look like a dumb dumb. Cool. Well, we win. <laughs> Turns out that whole time we were going to win anyway. So cool. We did it. We won our first game. We're up against Yorion this game. I don't mind this hand. Yeah, it's fine. I'll take another land. I could, I could use that. I could go for that. All things considered, it's not too bad. Start on Scorpion. That's right. That's right, Yorion opponent. I'm playing Serrated Scorpion. There are still a few jank people out here. <laughs> Fighting the good fight. <laughs> eh, I kind of just want to charge her this turn. But maybe Bone Crusher's better. Bone Crusher into Bone Crusher might be what we do. See if they counter the Bone Crusher with a Drawry Disruption or something. That is the fashion right now. Yeah, I got it. No, they don't. <laughs> Been off tonight. <laughs> I guess we need the red source here. Hmm. I do like the ability to double spell. I do. I do think that's pretty cool. 
Yeah, we're getting in. Put him at 16. Stormfist. Come on, bud. You want some cards? Yeah, it's good for everybody. It's totally cool. It's Fireblade. I would love for them to waste a, like a spell on that. Oh, they borrow the Crusader. Okay, whatever. That does kind of suck, but <laughs> could be worse, I guess. Acquisitions expert. Oh, here, here. It's been garbage so far. <laughs> Shock the expert. I did not expect to see expert in this deck. It's the Orion pile. Throw down Crusader, get three for two. We are very slowly, slowly doing damage, but we're doing it, baby. <laughs> What's up, fellow nerds? <laughs> What's up, Knife34? It's good to have you in here. Knives out, everybody. Atris, okay. A creature-based Yorion deck. Let's try and trick them. They almost always take two cards. Yeah, they do. Because that's what you do. Now, look at They have a grip full of cards over there. Where's the lands? Bring some lands to this party, baby. Let's, uh, I guess, just stomp the Atras. Get on through. Put them at nine, son. They play a bunch of creatures. That means they probably don't play sweepers. Let's hope. It would suck to get these two things extinction evented. Or Shadow's Verdict. That would also suck, but. <laughs> that would suck a lot of butt right now. Overwhelmed Apprentice. Okay. I like the Steez. I'm a fan of the Apprentice. Thanks for fueling this Crocs up for us. I guess. Disciple. Perhaps Disciple number one. Pitch the Crocs. Uh. Thanks. And acquisition. Yeah, I, th I thought that might happen. I thought something similar might occur. Draw. Draw. It's a land, so that's cool. Don't have a second black source, but we can't quite quark so yet anyway. Well, yeah, we can. We could have. Hmm. That's fun. Everybody, well, eh, you you hang around. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Limit seven. Bone crusher. Scorpion, double scorpion, baby. What are you gonna do about double scorpion? It's too much. It's too much for anybody. <laughs> Unless you have verdict right now. I mean, all these disciples and acquisitions expert. There's no way. Blood on the snow. Oh, oh man. Mm, mm, just delicious. Joker smile. Oh, goodness. Goodness. God gracious. Jeezy crazy. Cheese and crust. So that's what you're doing. That's what you're doing over there. Okay. Well, it's Bone Crusher, and hopefully it stays alive for a turn. That's all we care about. God. That was pretty sick. <laughs> Blood on the snow, get back in Atris. I'm down for that's Cool. Cool play. Covetous urge. That's so dumb. <laughs> How do you get bodied by a covetous urge? Oh, it's so sick, dude. Oh, we drew a land. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> I will put this on top. We're just going to crocs the next turn, but I'll put it on top. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, covetous urge, dude. Covetous urge, bruh. <laughs> oh no. God. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> I can't not love that, dude. 
<laughs> so sexy. Oh, man, thank you. Thanks, you got my Crocs with another covetous urge. Oh, man. <laughs> That's why Apprentice is in the deck. Thanks for giving me my other Crocs. <laughs> and you don't have enough mana for another urge. I think you played a land this turn. Good lord. Oh, man, dude. <laughs> Governor's urge. They put a card on top, so I mean, I guess we gotta worry, right? <laughs> they hadn't played a land yet. Do do you have a third covetous urge? No. Okay, they buy Yorion. It's just so sick, dude. That was so sick. <laughs> covetous urge. Are you sure? <laughs> They're gonna scoop to Croxa. But valiantly played opponent. Good game. GG opponent. I'm very proud of you. <laughs> Come to Surge, dude. <laughs> At least you hung in there a couple of turns. Opponent goes first. We definitely have more black sources than red sources in our deck, so I keep getting way more red sources. But I guess this is a fine hand on a fine Tuesday afternoon. Up against Totoro Darts. Upstanding opponent. Probably. I don't know this person. <laughs> I don't want to vouch for them. Temple of Mystery to start, so actually, they're awful. <laughs> let's, let's temple ourselves here. Temple ourselves right here in front of all these people? Let's put the serrated scorpion on bottom. 45 bits from Officer Blunt. Thank you very much for the GG. I appreciate that. Also, Fleet 47, you gave me 102 bits for almost the whole gang being here. I guess we are missing stats, aren't we? <laughs> I haven't seen stats tonight. Well, Stormfist, there's another Lovestruck Beast. It killed us last time. Let's see if it does so again. Hey, they Lovestruck Beast? We got a Royal Eruption and a Shock. I will get three for one on this Lovestruck Beast if I have to. Because they got a token out of it, too. It's a three for one. Naturalist. Okay, so... Nothing but creatures in their deck, apparently. Throw down Mountain. I could just Crusader again. <laughs> Double Crusader, have a shock open? Why not? Because I could Bastion, and Bastion's pretty good. I do like Bastion. Although... <laughs> Go for the, the uh, burn kill here. <laughs> In the turn. It's so like, if I just deal two damage a turn with Stormfist Crusaders and I have a Royal Eruption and a Shock in my hand, we might be able to pull it off. <laughs> I'm going to play Beast this turn, aren't you? Ooh, okay. Okay, all right. Kennen. Where's Kel? Lovestruck Beast. Is Kanan really as scary as I think it is? Probably not. You know? Kanan's not that big of a deal. It's really not. Like, for that matter, is Lovestruck Beast even that big of a deal? Should I two for one myself on Lovestruck Beast when I can just play blockers, you know? I can play Fireblade, Charger, Serrated Scorpion, and still have enough to, like, Royal Eruption here. Or I could, like, Serrated Scorpion Bastion and have two blockers. I can't do that because I don't have enough black. But Where's all the black mana the last couple of games? Yeah. I'm doing it, dude. Serrated Scorpion, Fireblade Charger, Royal Eruption Face. It's 14, right? And then we just, like, have blockers. And we, we end up, if they can't kill Stormfist Crusader, they have to get through for a bunch of damage or they just can't win. That's a that's a way to take the game, you know? I don't have to play Eruption right now. I can always shock the Kanan. Yeah, I'm going to save the Royal Eruption for right now. It's like, I might be screwing this up. Also, maybe attacking the Stormfist there would have been an idea. They can double block, but they lose their 1-1. So that's an idea, but 
I never like to do stuff like that because they almost always have another one one, whether it's innkeeper or another love struck in their hand. So I just feel like that's really, really risky. Another canon. That sucks. I feel like we lost a shock for no reason there. So now they have four mana. You know what? I would hate to see a love uh, a, a questing beast. That would be awful. Oh, it's a Toski. It's not great either. But they can attack. <laughs> so that's good news. <laughs> Three cards a turn. Pretty hot. Let's get our second black mana. Now we can like Bastion into Scorpion. Hold on to this Royal Eruption. Toski's so good with Love Struck Beast. I've got um Selesnya Adventures built right now with Toski, a four of Toski in it, and it's so they're just so good, dude. That deck is sweet. <laughs> that deck is very good. I'm gonna get in with Charger here. They may block with Toski, but if they do that, I'm just gonna hit him in the face. I can also kill this other 1-1, one, one, but I think it's actually better to do this. We're finally, uh, you know, away from life parity. <laughs> so, they gotta do stuff. Have I considered doing limited content? Yeah, I have. I actually really enjoy doing limited content. Oh, that's a cute idea. Look there, I guess we can card her next turn if we want to. Oh my god, Coma. Oof, well, I guess we didn't expect that. <laughs> I, <laughs> I gotta say, the last thing I expected was Coma. Ugh, that really complicates things. Did we just draw three lands? That's stupid. It's really stupid, Arena. Why'd you do that? Why'd you draw three lands in a row? That's... Come on, man. Need... Need a little more help than that. Woof. Just woof, you know? God. Still getting over the sting of that. If we card her and make everyone attack, then what happens? <laughs> I guess we'll find out, won't we? <laughs> Let's see. Let opponent read it. Okay. Croxa. Gotta save this eruption. I mean, one, two, three, four, five, six. So next turn we can eruption for five. So pretty cool. They pitch a Toski. Take one. We only have like three other cards in our yard right now. No attacks. We get a 3-3. Three, three. Everyone has to attack this turn. Long time listener, first time caller. What's up, Harley Quinn 2000? Good to have you on stream, friend. Naturalist comes down. All right, so everything attacks. We can do this. We can easily do this. <laughs> we win, right? <laughs> I imagine, let's have a counter spell for the Royal Eruption. All right, here comes everybody. Let's block here. Let's block here. We know we want to do that. Let's block here. Attacking creature will die, so that's good. We also want that. Actually, let's block like this so that as many of our creatures die as possible. That's I think we also want that because of Bastion. And... Block here. 
Yeah. So I don't know why I'm not blocking this. All right. <laughs> Just had to look at it for a second. Like, what am I missing? <laughs> All right, that's a bunch of uh, triggers. So two, four, five, six, seven. They go to three, two, one, zero. Okay, cool. <laughs> that's, that's how the deck works, kid. <laughs> that's what it's supposed to do. Okay, so that's fine. Fine hand. Probably need a little bit of action for slightly later on, but in terms of the beginning of the game, this is all right. Is all right. Is all right. Give up. 347 to regular space Joe is all right is all right scorpion opponent gives us a hello let's give him one back to be nice I know some people when their opponent says hello they say your go and uh, uh, that's horrible don't do that to people <laughs> opponent also gave us a little heart emojis so they apparently are a fan or possibly are stream sniping <laughs> let's, let's hope it's the uh, former Get in. That's right. We played a creature before our combat stuff. That's bad magic. Bad magic. Acquisitions expert. <laughs> well, second acquisitions expert of the stream so far tonight. Let's get rid of Fury. We don't need that garbage. That garbage. I don't know why I'm so hard on Fury. <laughs> Stomp them in the nuts. Stomp, stomp them in the nuts. Then put them down to 15. Game starts pretty good. It's not bad. It's not bad. Need another black source for Ayara. But this one of Ayara probably needs to come out of the deck. We've seen it twice tonight and it hadn't really been great. <laughs> Omen of the De Ooh, I see you. I see you, kid. What, what, what sexy moves you got over there on the dance floor. Actually, you know what? Screw this Ayara. <laughs> I don't want it. I want the other land more. <laughs> Dope. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go, kid. <laughs> Better start gaining some life, son. <laughs> Opponent at 12. Oh, my goodness. What are we? What is this, dude? <laughs> this is nuts. Let's give them a thanks. They did give us a nice. I wasn't sure if they did. I thought I saw it in my peripheral. My periphery. Opponent has four mana and nowhere to go, which is concerning. <laughs> you gotta have something over there, baby. Dude, we're gonna get all four of these out. We're gonna get every single one of these out. <laughs> it's just nuts. Quattro! <laughs> how, is it, how, how is that happening? Opponent has a million cards in their hand. <laughs> See if we get to draw four next turn. I sincerely hope we do, but uh, I don't think so. Are you going to play a flash creature? Oh, okay, you are. Cool. Oh, don't double block. Don't double block. Don't take this away from me. <laughs> I mean, they have to double block because it has menace, so, you know. The expert in front. That's what we want. Well, is it... Maybe I should have gotten rid of the token. Now there's an expert in their yard, and we know they run reanimation, so. Probably actually stupid. Yeah, see, I'm stupid. What a dumb head. Oh, yeah. How do you beat discard? Draw four a turn. Yeah. <laughs> We're still going to draw four next turn, even though we lost a Crusader. That's so silly, dude. <laughs> I'm going to put him at four. I'm just going to put him at four, and then we Carter. What do you have? Can you sweep the board this turn? Because that would be what you would like to do, I imagine. Yeah, extinction event. Boo! Boo! <laughs> Boo! Extinction event. Boo! <laughs> well, snip snap. We win anyway. <laughs> Scorpion. Kazil's Fury. The Scorpion. Well, no, let's not target the Scorpion. Huh? Eh? Yeah. That's right. <laughs> this deck is a boss. <laughs> it turns out, what are we, three out of four tonight? Something like that? Dude, it really wants us to get these Crusaders. That's nuts. 
A good opening hand, too. If I say so myself. Scorpion. Also wants us to have scorpions. Get them every game. What's going on with Manfred Vaughn over there? Manfred Vaughn what? Usually there's a third word here. Oh, Evolving Wilds. Okay. Gotta watch out for like brush fires and stuff, I guess. Stormfist. This is exactly the way the last game started. Three Kazul's Fury. <laughs> it's pretty silly that we have that many Kazul's Fury. Yeah, you pop your wilds. Everybody pops wilds on attack step. I think you made a real pain in the neck of a deck this time. Yeah, regular place, Joe. It's uh seems that way, doesn't it? Oh, disciple. Is this the only stuff we're planning is tonight? Disciple acquisitions expert. That's it. That's the whole night. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> oh my goodness. You love to see it, dude. <laughs> it's so silly. Yeah, it's got menace. You see. It's an ability. It means can't do it. Okay, so they want Disciple in the yard. Which means they have some form of reanimation. I'll get rid of the other Fury. I do not care. I, I don't care. Croxa! I see. Can drop a land without dropping a land. You got a... Oh, it's a village rights. Okay. Wow, so we just get a free bunch of damage this turn. I like that. I will always like that. I feel like if we can get our opponent's life total low enough in some of these games, we just auto win, you know? Got a million ways to win once their life total's low. Can I draw a real card? Thank you. <laughs> well, I sure am tempted to play the other Crusader. <laughs> it's probably better just to Bastion into Charger here. Fill our board with duders. Now what do you do? You need Extinction Event. Which wouldn't completely solve your problems, but hey, it helps. Glad we didn't play the other Crusader. That's your whole turn, son. Or daughter. Could be. I don't know. Oh, you have to discard. Wow, it's like that. <laughs> Watch out. They can Crocs the next turn. And we will have a land in our hand when, when they do so. Kind of hoping that wasn't about to happen, but whatever. Go to seven. They go to six, five, four, at least three next turn. Well, two, really. I think we just got them. Unless they have another event, that would suck. This apparently is just the, you know, million removal spells. Yep, there's another extinction event. Dumb. Dumb. Falmar Knight. How many more could you possibly have in your deck? Hazel's Fury. Okay, so six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Okay, cool. So let's just uh, let's just win. Why don't we just win the game? How about we just do that instead? I don't know. We're messing around with all this garbage. We just win. <laughs> Boop. Boop. This gets really just that easy, folks. <laughs> it turns out. Right, four and one. Is that four and one or are we five and one? I, it's, I've lost count. The deck is just so good. But these games have been going super fast. I think there's probably some tweaks we need to make to this deck, but I like this deck. I do like this deck. It's Temple, turn one. Oh, Stormfist. <laughs> Just like make sure you get Stormfist, man. <laughs> Four Stormfist Crusaders? Yeah, we've definitely. <laughs> we got them all in the same game a couple of games ago. Oh, I forgot to make this our active deck on Twitch. I have to do that, man. As soon as this one's over. Maybe we'll lose one this time. Maybe we'll lose again. <laughs> this deck is awesome, Officer Blunt. <laughs> 100 from Flea. Four Stormfist Crusaders? Or 100 from uh, Tadru. Four Stormfist Crusaders? Yeah, all four. They foretell a card in their Rakdos deck. That's interesting. Definitely piques my interest. 
I honestly think I just want a Scorpion this turn. Rather have that. Put him at 17. Dude, Crusader's been an all-star, too. Crusader has been an all-star in this deck, man. Stormfist and Ugin, all the deck needs. <laughs> Apparently. I need to add Ugin. I think we may have gotten to eight lands once. Because <laughs> we drew all those lands. We drew like four lands in a turn from Stormfist Crusaders. Ooh, crush the weak. That's going to suck. Does that end our game? I think it might. This Ayara has to come out. I don't like it at all. I don't even think we have enough black creatures to really make the one-up worth it. I just liked it because it does damage. But I think I'd just rather have like another shock. <laughs> so it's Grixis. Grixis Giants? <laughs> Perhaps they're just Grixis Control. I think it's Grixis Control. Right, man, we can Carter, we can Ayara. I wonder what they've got foretold over there. Probably a saw it coming, right? It has to be. So let's play the card I care about the least. Hmm. I wonder if they have removal for it. It's at 14. Well, uh, well, not Eruption. I want to play around like Drawy Disruption. Keep that until we need it. Thirst. Okay. I wonder if they discard an enchantment card here. Or if they're just purely playing it for card draw. Oh, uh, maybe it's a reanimation deck. That's possible, right? Oh, well, they just pitch two lands. Okay. This is a counter spell, right? I mean, it. I mean, it just is. It just is a counter spell. Why would it not be? What could it be, if not counter spell? Well, swing on in. They're gonna do something. Eliminate. Three, one, two. Eh, sure. And they've still got counter spell mana. Got a crusher. They've got so many cards in their hand, dude. Not looking good. I think we perform best against like small creature decks. Neutralize. Should I save this eruption until we have two more mana? Nah. Nah. I just want to get their life total down. Put them at nine with the shock. There's a way we finish this game, but I don't think it's going to happen. I'm pretty sure that we've lost this one. Just look at how many cards are in their hand, dude. They, they never run out of cards in their hand. It's kind of insane how many cards stay in their hand from turn to turn. Another foretell. So, uh, it's definitely... Look at the mana, dude. It's definitely saw it coming. I, I think we all see this coming, but I have to try to play a threat this turn. Just do it. No, you don't have to read it. You know you're going to... I mean, it's a 4-3 body. You have to do something. You don't have to counter it. I mean, I guess you could... Scorching Dragon fire it? It's a thing that can happen. It's possible. This is where I really wish we had the third mana open here. Crush the weak. So we're going to... I guess we're going to two for one them. Pretty cool. Cinder clip. Man, you're really worried about small creatures. It's like these cards don't even work against like the mono white deck, so. Huh. Croxa. Into Croxa. <laughs> Pretty cool. Well, I guess we can't. Why don't we have more cards in our graveyard than that? Why aren't there more cards in our yard? <laughs> That's unbelievable. <laughs> I feel like they've just been doing nothing but countering stuff all game. I guess they exiled stuff with Crush. One, two, three. Yeah, or else we would have. We would have enough cards. I'm going to shock you in your stupid face. <laughs> <clears throat> I 
All right. Well, we have a chance to win the game next next turn. Where's this other mana? I want it so bad. What's the card? We still have a chance. This Croxa gives us a serious chance at winning this game. Just put it in my yard. Just put it in my yard, dude. I just want it in my in my graveyard. That's all I want. Just put this Carter into my graveyard. Deposit it there for me. I will be more than happy with that. It's totally fine. Okay. <laughs> it's on. It's on the table. Yes. Yeah, so you're telling me there's a chance that? Oh my God, there is. There actually is. Ooh, Stormfist might actually be pretty good. I won't not take it. Let's try and get in. Wow, okay. They just won't put it in our yard, dude. They just will not. Counterspell. Doesn't even win the game, so it's not it's not the right play right now anyway. Let's just try and let him let's let him try to kill the Carter and then respond with the Fury. Inescapable Blaze? <laughs> Dope. <laughs> Alright. Target you. Sacrifice this. Go to one. Alright, well. That is enough cards in our graveyard, and we have enough to cast both of these next turn, so. Let's go. Let's go. Oh no! Iron Crag feet into what? Well, I guess we can just win. Why don't we just win the game? Why don't we just stop belly aching and win? Why don't we just do that, you know? Yeah, the less. I, I see it. I see it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the one at the beginning of the stream that was like, let's not forget about Skullcairn. 